Hi, this is um, the first of a series of FAQs, and this is one that we get a lot of. Um, the version I'm showing you here is the current version released in of Invivo, released in um, March 2020. So it's referred to mostly as Invivo 2020, but sometimes referred to as R1. And the problem I'm going to show you arises most often when people have upgraded to the newer version from the old version, which was version 12. But it can happen in either. And it's really where people get a, a fright. <laughs> they, they open up their um, their software, usually for the first time after upgrading, and they, they email us then in a panic to say their files have disappeared or their coding has disappeared. A and it hasn't, but the area on the left here, uh, the marked in blue, known as Navigation View in all versions of Invivo to date, looks a bit different in this version and sometimes what are actually folders don't really look like folders. So if I just pull in version 12 here for a second and show it to you, it was a bit clearer in version 12 that these were actually folders. So you can see there's a little arrow to the left of files indicating that there are subfolders. And if I expand on that, you can see the subfolders. And if I click on a subfolder, I can see its content. And the same for coding. That isn't quite as obvious in the current version because the screen, the background is blue. It's, it kind of looks more like a menu than um, folders, but they are actually folders and behave exactly the same way. You create them and rename them and do put content in them the same as you would in version 12. So the little arrow indicating there that there are subfolders, uh, there are subfolders and there's my files, from example, my interviews, and the same with my coding, my various stages of coding, uh, you know, um, or different types of coding that I'm producing. Um, and we get an email about once a week from somebody in that panicked state. So we'll, we've recorded this to help uh, alleviate that stress. So if you, um, if you found that tip helpful, then um, like and subscribe. Have a nice day.